The most violent year was full of promise for me. I was very excited about seeing a, a sort of crime drama set in 1981, starring two of my favourite actors, Oscar Isaac and Jessica Chastain, and directed by J.C. Chander, who directed that great sailing disaster movie, All Is Lost, starring Robert Redford. But do you know what? It was a big disappointment. This is about a guy who is building an empire, distributing heating oil. And if you think that sounds boring, you're absolutely right. It is boring. He's married to a, a woman who is the daughter of a low-life mobster. So she turns into a bit of a Lady Macbeth character. He's trying to do it straight without involving organised crime. But at the same time, his tankers are being hijacked. She's trying to persuade him that he just needs to get heavy on everybody's asses. This is about a straight guy trying to keep straight. That's not really that exciting. You're always waiting for drama and thrills. When they come, they're not that dramatic or that thrilling. The two leads, they're absolutely fine, but at the end of the day, I was just a bit bored during a most violent year.